Hello friends, welcome back to the tutorial of Adiano using IoT, that is Internet of Things. So in our last video, we have learned a basic introduction of Adiano and also how to install Adiano IDE on which we are going to make a program so that it can work on a project. So in today's session, I am going to teach you how to blink an LED using a Diano board. But before starting, I would recommend you to have a basic knowledge of C and C++ so that you won't face difficulty to understand the coding written in this Adiano board. So when you are having a basic knowledge of C and C++ language, so we can start with Adiano. So before starting, we would first make the connections on a breadboard that are going to be connected with Adiano board. So let's go and make a connections for LED blinking. So this is a circuit that I have made on the breadboard. Here, this this side this is the positive side of our LED, and this one is the negative side and I have connected a 330 ohm resistor from positive rail to a VCC so I will just connect here one jumper and other jumper on the negative rail of a LED and now I will directly connect it to my Arduino board so let's just make the connection so this is my Arduino Uno board on which I will make connections from breadboard that I have made for my LED. So I will just connect the black one that is the positive rail. I will just connect it to the digital input pin from where I will give it the VCC or the ground or we can say the high logic or the low logic so that I can make it blink with a particular time delay and the other side I will just connect it to the ground so I have just made the connections and I will just write the code so that it can blink accordingly with the time delay that I will provide it so now I will connect my Arduino board to my laptop so that I can directly communicate it to my laptop and so that I can upload my program directly into the Arduino board. So now we have made the connections of LED blinking on our breadboard so we can write a code on this Arduino IDE software. So let's just write the code. Before writing, I'll just increase the font size. So I'll just change the value of 16 to around 25. Okay. Now, before starting with the code, I would like to tell you that there are two functions that are already shown here. That is, one is void setup and the other is void loop. The meaning of both are that anything that is written inside this setup loop will only be run once. That you can also see that it is written here with comments. Put your setup code here to run once because anything you write inside this loop it will just run once and after that it will just go to the void loop and inside whatever it is it will repeat it again and again so that the code will work so what i will do now go before the void setup just write int led equals to 2 what i am doing here is i am just storing the value inside this LED variable 
so that I can use this pin with this variable name also this LED if you don't want to put this you can directly write this a pin number that I will show you how so we will write here pin mode within brackets 2 comma output and column so what does it mean it means that you are defining your pin means you have connected pin of LED to the digital pin tube of Ideano which I am going to use as an output so I am just defining here this is the pin number 2 that I am using for the LED so that I can make it on and off but instead of this LED instead of this 2 we can write here LED because I have stored my value it means inside this LED variable there is 2 which means there is a value stored 2 and here we need 2 so I can use it directly or indirectly and now I have defined my bin so I will just go to the loop and I will just tell him what it has to do so for that I will just write digital write within brackets LED means to which pin I am going to give a high or low value comma high high means I am putting my LED high and there I have put colon colon means termination and now I have to tell Adiano that for how long it will be on or it will be high so I will just type a delay delay within brackets let's say I will just put it on for 1000 milliseconds and colon and I am writing the code for LED blinking so I have to turn it off also so I will just copy and paste it and change the value of high to low what does it mean? it means it will turn my LED high for one second it will turn my LED low for one second so this was a program for LED blinking so let's just check it out just click on verify but before verify it will ask you to save the file so I will just go to desktop give it a name or just enter so I will just give a name LED and save it so now it has start compiling so it is compiling sketch so my compiling is done without any error so I will just directly upload my program from Ardiano software to my Ardiano board so before that I will just select the port my port is automatically selected so I do not need to select it but if the port is not selected in your laptop so you have to go to tools port and just select for the port whichever it is showing I do not need to select it so I will directly upload it so my uploading is done so let's see whether it is working or not so here we can see our LED is blinking with a time delay of 1 second means 1 second on 1 second off and it is repeating again and again so this was the program for LED blinking similarly we can make the program for different LEDs and in a different manner so this was it for today thanks for watching this video but if you like this video please press the like button 
and if you do not have subscribed to my channel please press the subscribe button so that you can get the updates from me thank you